It wasn't your average campaign stop. Democratic U.S. Senate candidate Marquita Bradshaw went skydiving in Greene County today, calling it a leap of faith reflective of her grassroots campaign. My name is Marquita Bradshaw, and I'm working hard with all of you to become your next United States Senator. With few big donors or major endorsements, some considered Bradshaw's win in the Democratic primary a shock. But now her campaign is traveling through Tennessee's 95 counties. And a drop from 11,000 feet in the air into Greene County didn't seem to worry her. I didn't say in my prayers, I'm good. Campaigning as a working class mother from Memphis, she says she's different from establishment politicians. Well, I'm not a rich white man, and so I don't use the same tools that rich white men use. I know people. I work with hardworking families all across this state. Bradshaw's platform includes Medicare for All, support for the Green New Deal, and a $15 per hour minimum wage. When asked how she'd like the Supreme Court seat vacated by the passing of Ruth Bader Ginsburg to be filled, Bradshaw said she believes the next president should choose the nominee. This is a warning to Mitch McConnell. Let me tell you, if you proceed with this process, we will install a no new Democratic U.S. Senate come January 3rd, 2021. Woo! Nice job. What do you think of that? <laughs> Amazing. After sticking the landing, a final message to the voters. Right now, working families across Tennessee, they want a voice and they need a voice. And Mark Peter Bradshaw has had voice. We're about to make history together. Bradshaw will go up against Republican opponent Bill Hagerty this November. In Greene County, Kaylin Cluck, News Channel 11.